Here are a bunch of new features for the AutoWear Tiles action. As you may know, a tile is something that you can add at the right of the main screen on your watch, something like this. In this case, it's a simple text tile with the text hello. And this is configured here, down here. But I have a few more examples to show you how this works. So in this example, I have uh, sorry, let me just edit this. In this example, I can I change the type to buttons and then set my text to three metals, the top label to metals, the bottom label to you want all three, and then a border text that says congratulations. If I run this, this shows up. As you can see, it has three buttons and then the congratulations at the top here and the text I defined. I can make the buttons do different things if I want to, but this is just a simple example. If I edit this and change the file type to progress, and you have specific progress options down here that you can change, but then it'll look something like this. The same, the text is the same, the border can be changed to show some progress, for example, right now the progress is set to 52. Let's change the progress minimum to zero, the progress maximum to 100, which is the default, and then let the progress be 52. And if I do this, you can see that the progress has changed to 52%. And now there's even another text, another type, I mean, which is text list. And this simply shows a list of texts like this. The rest remains the same, but now the list of your texts will be shown as a vertical list like this. And to better show off this new uh, type, type of tile, I've created this example, which shows a schedule like this. It shows a list of texts with the header, a subheader if you want to. The first one doesn't have the header. And you can change the colors between each text like this. So just as an example, let's try adding a border text like the other screen had. The border text could say something like Friday and then 13th October something like this. And as you can see, the border text showed up up there. But now I can even customize this border text further by going here and then using a special uh, border text command, which is a line. If I do L and then equals, colon equals, and then some uh, angle you want, in this case 15 degrees, then there will be a 15 degree line between one text and the other, as you can see there. I can also add spaces. So for example, if I go to border text again, and I can add a space here, S equals colon equals, then for example, 4, and then after this one, add another text and another space, S equals colon equals, and then four again. So this will add a space after the word Friday, before the line, and then another space after the line. And so it'll look something like this. Looks pretty good. As I mentioned before, each type you select here has a different uh, configuration option down here. So for the text list, you can add header headers and subheaders. For the progress, you can change the progress, the colors, the progress track color, etc. And for the buttons, you can change a bunch of a bunch of button-related stuff. But there's also this part here which is 
the same for all screens and will apply to all screens equally. So that's why when I change the type, you could see that most of the stuff remain between screens. So these are some of the new AutoWare tile features. I hope you enjoyed this and let me know if you would like to see another type of screen before um, besides the buttons, progress, and text list, if you'd like to see any other type of screen so I could maybe add it. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.